Break news coming in this morning. The Indian Tax Tribunal has issued a show cause notice to businessman Hassan Ali asking why proceedings shouldn't be initiated against him. He was given it has given Hassan Ali 15 days time to reply. Hassan Ali, who owns a stud farm in India's and is India's number one tax defaulter, is now consulting his lawyers and is exploring two options. He could choose to reply to the IT tribunal's notice or challenge it by moving the High Court. Ali has already been interrogated by the Enforcement Directorate in Mumbai over cross-border transactions. Earlier, Hassan Ali was served notices on a 40 lakh crores fine for tax evasion. Let's get a word from our correspondent Toral Varya tracking developments to that story. Toral, the Income Tax Department acting after an indictment from the Supreme Court. Uh, well, not really, because this is a, this has been an ongoing proceedings against Hassan Ali. We know that our case against Hassan Ali had been registered as many as three years ago. And uh, what really has been happening is that Hassan Ali and the Income Tax uh, Department are going back and forth as far as the legalities are concerned. Uh, Income Tax Department believes that Hassan Ali is responsible for evading taxation worth crores of rupees. And the penalty to the tax taxation comes up to at least 40,000 crores. Um, that's an astounding amount. And we know that Hassan Ali had challenged the findings of the assessment department of income tax uh, in the tribunal. And this notice, the show cause notice, which is the latest development, uh, has been issued by the tribunal asking Hassan Ali as to why he should not be prosecuted under various sections of the Income Tax Act. Now, Hassan Ali has 15 days of time. Approximately on 15th or the 17th of March, he is expected to file a reply with the tribunal. But what Hassan Ali perhaps could choose to do is move the High Court. We have been in constant touch with his uh, closed eyes and we know that he is exploring the option of filing a writ petition in the High Court challenging the show cause notice. That's one part. That's the part as far as the income tax department is concerned. But as far as the enforcement directorate is concerned, that is the agency which has a mandate of investigating money that has been parked by Indian nationals across the border in foreign na foreign countries. Now, Enforcement Directorate also believes that there are huge losses uh, and huge amount of Hawala transactions that have been executed by Hassan Ali, uh, leading to a lot of loss to the Indian exchequer. So, in a sense, both these agencies are, in a sense, zeroing on Hassan Ali and trying to get Hassan Ali to get into a corner. Thural Valia, our correspondent, telling us about the options available in front of Hassan Ali. Thural, thanks so much for that update.